In our previous Chase Camera project video, we designed and built the Chase Camera Pod, but it was destroyed when it hit the water column on the second flight. We were able to repair the internal 808 car keys camera, but we decided that a new, smaller and lighter fuselage would be better. In part two of the US Water Rockets Chase Camera project, we repair and improve the design and then show results from several successful flights. The new Chase Camera Pod was quickly fabricated from the common materials shown here and it was test flown many times with great results. Have a look at these great launch videos. This launch impacts with the water column, but no damage was found. You can see we added a lot of talcum powder to the parachute in these videos to add some dramatic effect to the chase camera views. All of the test flights in this video use our MSP430 launchpad based deploy electronics and our radial deploy system. You can see how to build these systems by following the links in the description of this video. We hope that you've enjoyed this video from part 2 of our Chase Camera project. If you click on the video links below, you can view part 1 of the Chase Camera project. Or, you can learn how to make the radial parachute deploy system featured in these launch videos. Or you can even learn our technique for joining multiple bottles together to form giant water rockets like the ones seen in this video. Don't forget to subscribe. We'll see you next time.